Hello and welcome back to HIP. So, we are getting all of the men to Constantinople and we're about to take the last land that we need from the Caliphate. So, that's pretty good to me. Sounds fantastic. Wait, we've also got like slight disease going on. Let's not worry about it. You want to marry this person? Sure, whatever. I don't care. New ambition. Oh yeah, we had the be at peace ambition. That's not going to happen. Um... Ten children? One, two, three, four, five, six. Wife's 39. None of these are gonna work. Okay, I wanna convert a province. Am I still working on that? Kinda, yeah. Let's try converting. The Egyptian coronation. Fantastic. Right. Uh, that's a lot of men. That seems like enough for round one. There's not that much to siege, because we've just been here and sieged it all. We are losing some uh, stuff, because they already had an army raised and they were already sieging. Actually, we should move forward one more. Move the 14,000 in. We should double siege, because we can, basically. I think that's the best strategy we have. Uh, we should have, yeah, 235 we can put in there. So all of our boats, yeah. So I can actually disband them now. Okay, that's fine. Continue our sieges. Both of them are uh, port level 6 or above, so we can't assault them. Looks like the uh, harsh winter is gone. Yeah, deliver me the people you found again. We'll get some more money out of them. Right. Uh, assault that down. Nice. And assault that one down. Assault that one down. See, this is how we're getting the war score quickly. The constant assaults of lands that we've just assaulted about 10 seconds ago. Nice, we're converting people. Uh, it's fort level 6 or above. That one's already sieged. Well, head through there. We might take some attrition while we're heading through, but that's alright. Only 100 men on this one. Well, definitely assault it. 200. 300. This seems very, very good. This is so much war score so quickly. Uh, yeah. Well, we might as well siege this one properly. We got about 75% war score instantly. Yeah, head through there. Go meet up. We won this siege. Um, I'm going to move the 20,000 away slightly. Not very far away. Um... I, I've got two reasons to uh, say I can't go. I'm busy and there's a war. <laughs> okay. Not busy because there's a war. I'm busy and there's a war. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I should merge up those armies. Need a new marshal. That's going to be that guy. New steward. I see. Is it going to be that guy? Could really be uh, that guy. And then my commander should be him. Yeah. That seems better. Um, yeah, but because we are currently hidden, we're currently hiding from the disease, we can't actually um, use him as a commander anyway. It's fine. Please don't siege my land right in front of me. It's very rude. Right. I have to go over there and stop that. Uh, make sure we have leaders, which we do. Uh, did I manage to not click on these two? Impress it. Wait, did I? I managed to click on the army, which that's uh, that's that's a new one for me. Right, defeat the army that is attacking us. Offer peace. We surrender. Accept. Uh, yeah, we choose the middle option there. Threw my ultimatum in my face, uh, and we have his vassal. That's fine. We've now taken that. This land is ours directly. And we can give that to whoever this guy is. What's that? It starts with an A. Yeah. That's fine. He now likes us. He wants control, which I think means we have to transfer that vassal to him. Fine. He now likes us at 100. That's good. Okay. Imperial Decay went down even further. And if we check our lovely Restore the Roman Empire thing... The only thing out of everything that we're missing 
is the Prince Archbishopric of Latium, otherwise known as uh, the Papacy. So, that's yeah, going to be difficult. Yeah, very, very difficult. But I think we can manage, just about. We are very good at uh, kind of storming down for wars. Uh, let's give you a martial education. Now I'm wondering, and I think I should actually send my army over here, like my retinue, and just uh, maybe sit them in that territory between two of our, yeah, that territory between two of our vassals, because that gets us an instant. If I have a look here, that's an instant five thousand. And I didn't really want to open the extended province view. Uh, and an insta another instant 5,000. So yeah, we can get um, 15,000 immediately to attack the Pope. Which seems very, very good. I mean, he only has 12,000 standing. He does have a lot of money. Well, he doesn't have as much as we do. But yeah, it seems like a good idea to head over there. Are we anti-Pope yet? No, that's fine. I suspect it was within the last 50... Well, I know it's within the last 50 years. That's why we can't do it. But, um, yeah. I suspect that uh, it was quite recent in the last 50 years. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Yesterday I found a book and read it for a while and put it somewhere went for a walk in the garden. Vaguely think I should get back to it later. Today I found a book again but couldn't remember uh, what it was about so I started reading it again. I'm content with my life. People think I should be more ambitious. Oh well. Shame. I'm very happy in my current position. Now we could take Latium piece by piece. And people did say if we get excommunicated, we should go to war with the Pope. Hmm. Yeah, I was thinking he'd say that. Just wondering if... Hmm. If we get excommunicated and we could war with the Pope, maybe that is a good idea. Mantua Holdings? Where are those? That's up there. I don't really want that land. Hmm. Could do unjust conquest. It cost us a lot of gold. That's scaling gold right there. And piety. And everybody in my religious group doesn't like me. And the Pope really, really doesn't like me. Glory faction likes us though. If we win. Hmm. I'm not sure it's a good idea. Um, I don't want Craven. I'm going to open the gates. Especially as it looks like the disease is mostly gone. That's fine. Uh, you want to reform the regulations used to blah de blah de blah de blah. That's fine, sure. As long as it doesn't raise Imperial Decay, I don't care. Right, uh, Grand Tourney? Definitely. Costs us a lot of money, but that's okay. We are going to get a lot of, we're going to get some Imperial Decay from it. A Jewish exile would like to be at my court. Sure. Why not? Doesn't seem like a problem to me. Uh, more Thems are being created as he gets money. Yeah, he's probably pretty strong right now. Yeah, 15,000 troops. He is very, very strong. He does like us a lot, but he's very strong. I'm not going to join the uh, competition. Doesn't really seem like our thing. Uh, I don't need to be told of every death. Please just tell me the top three and then let me get the Imperial Decay down. You would like this person to map? Sure, whatever. I don't even know who they are. Training ground's been built. Nice. Uh, let's build some... Stables for more retinue size. Alright, we're going to have a huge retinue at some point in the future. Uh, how much do we have? Can we get any more now? Uh, we can get another two, three, another three maybe. Not a big deal. We'll hold off on that for just now. We have a third place. Uh, right, I'm not going to give up anything for this person I don't even know. Um, oh, that's my kit. Kinsman did very well. Nice. And we have a winner. Nice. If I click this enough times, it'll work. There we go. One Imperial Decay down. Sure. I accept. Right. Carry on. Somebody try to kill us? Not specifically. That's fine. 
That's all I need to know, really. Right. Um, young Raul is doing something. I don't know. Why don't you become content, Raul? That's fine. Uh, ooh. They have declared a holy war. What, holy war for what? Al Joff. Uh, is that a duchy? Yeah, it is. Alright, so they're trying to take that bit of land. That's nice. Very, very good. Uh, yeah, we'll let City Guard handle it and then pay the money again. That's fine. We're continuing to convert individual people. Okay. Right. So, Papal States. If we could just get that claim, that'd be lovely. We are fabricating, aren't we? Yeah. I just need a claim on the duchy. That's all I really want. Yeah, somebody's a misguided warrior. Yeah, oh well. Um, okay. He's challenged me to a friendly game of Tice Canyon. Sure, we'll go for that. And... Yeah, we won. That's good. Absolutely not an issue for me. That person gave his support for me. That's good. Good. More bishop bricks. We have a heresy. Need a new despot. Luckily, we do have our son. He'll fill that role very nicely. Very, very much a loyalist. Yeah, okay. A whole bunch of things are being usurped. I think that's internal. Right. Yeah, more of them being usurped. Still kind of waiting for the claim. We have an uprising, which has been declared over here again. Okay, well... Now that we know that we can get a lot of men here very quickly. Get on the boats. Get on the boats. That's 20,000. We'll drop them in Carthage. Should be good. That'll do it. Right. Beat up that army. Beat up that army. He assaulted it down. Wow, that's very petty. Okay. We have crushed that one. Offer peace and force demands. Nice. Expand, get back in the boats, head back. Need a new commander. It's going to be Hesso. Right. Get on the boats. Head back. And uh, we should still be good. That's basically what I want to do to the Pope. But we can't quite do that yet. New commander, gonna be Leon, and then no antipopes. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. Uh, a new, uh, yes, that is our new heir. That's fine. Not really an issue. Never mind. The other ones are heir. Again, not really an issue. And we have a new heir. Okay, Raul finished his education. I don't know, Raul seems to have done very well. I mean, he was educated by us, in theory. Uh, oh, so there's one vote between them. But if we vote for Emmanuel... Who am I voting for here? If I vote for Emmanuel and both, there's a chance that we can do something good there? Right, I'm going to vote for Emmanuel and both. Instead of my son. Which is probably not going to make him like us very much, but... Is that even his name? Emmanuel, yeah. Fine, but that means that we're not on the edge anymore. We've made a decision. Uh, has our change here even affected things? We gave him one vote. I mean, that's kind of affected things. Ooh, building finished. Nice. Um, I get more stables. It's okay. All right. Still waiting for our chance. That's a whole bunch of things. He took a tur- uh, or she- he, he? He took a Terma. Um, right. What's that? Terma of Borsa. I figure out what he actually took. Probably got renamed. Uh, oh, a whole bunch of Termas. Oh, he took this land right there. That's what he took. That's good. Wait, no, he took this land right here. Oh, fantastic. He's actually connected our realm. 
almost all the way around. That's what I like to see. Byzantines are becoming strong again. Right, uh, get you that diplomacy education. Uh, people are not getting along, so I'll get make them get along. Uh, gonna ignore this entirely. This is our son something. Is his name Caesar, or is that... Caesar's just like Prince, I think, right? Or is it... Yeah, I think that is Caesar, or however you meant to say it. Anyway, uh, I actually, I guess I do want those to be gregarious. There's only 20 opinion on our side. Might as well make him a good character. Uh, yes, continue getting rid of events that we don't want to see. Seems like the game has got a little bit more sluggish since we started. It used to run very, very, very well. It's okay right now, but... You know, it's not quite as good as it was. Um, right, we'll go to our coronation. Whose coronation are we going to? Oh, the, uh... King of Flanders. Oh. Alright, sure. We'll go to his celebration, I guess. I'm not really that worried about it. Commander of the Byzantine Empire. You know what I was thinking? Is that if we were, in theory, to start declaring war on the Pope, we only need 50% of his land. So one, two, three, four, five. So we only need three provinces, right? From him to get all of it, in theory. As we can usurp the du well, we only need what? Oh, Walram is my good friend. But what we, I, I don't mean to get all of it, but I mean like, only three unjustified conquests to get it. If you know what I'm meaning. Like three unjustified conquests, then we can get the de jure claim. And that would work a little bit better. I don't know. I'd prefer if we just got a claim though. We've kind of been waiting on that a little bit here. Uh, no, go away. I don't want a mess of China. I've, I've just got my own power back. I don't need to mess with someone else's. Uh, sure. Sympathy for Islam. Sounds good. Absolutely fine. Um... Yeah, you like me. Why don't you be our, my steward and I'll get you to collect taxes for me. Seems pretty good. Ooh, and we can upgrade this one down here with some stables. Good. Keep our building up. Alright. So, we'll get a claim by December. That's my that's my new brilliant call. Claim by December. Also, Imperial Decay, get lowered. 38 is as low as it has ever been with us in charge. That's amazing. It's barely even a modifier now. Now, 46,000 troops. We are getting up there. Tonic Order. That's fine. They got another province. Okay, people are being converted. Good. Still waiting on the all-important bit. Uh, we have a son who's a skilled tactician. That's all right. Not really that impressed. Okay. Still waiting on our opportunity. At some point. Ooh, I wonder if we can make an antipope yet. Nope. That's fine. Uh, prosperity factions now friendly. Wait, you want me to press your claim on the Holy Roman Empire for the glory of our... Interesting. What is the succession law of the Holy Roman Empire? I think it's elective. It is elective. If he takes over, will it still be elective? Did he get that from his mother? He did get that from his mother. Hmm. Interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm considering it. Sorry, I went quiet for a little bit. I'm considering it because I have an inkling that it might switch to primogenitor upon us taking it. Although, hmm, if it does, that's really, really good. 
But at the same time, I... Hmm. It only has 4,000 troops. That's the thing. 4,000 troops. He's just come into power. He has no allies. We could absolutely annihilate him. I'm gonna ignore that for just now. I think we're gonna do it. Prepare for war. We start with 40% war score. <laughs> could it be any easier? When you start with war score. Okay, well, uh, we'll raise up a couple troops. And, uh, let's go to war. Right, thanks for watching. I'm going to end the episode here and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.